Hello guys, welcome back to Tech Bay. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a table controller programmatically. So, create new Xcode project. Select single view app, give next, give a product name. Let be table. Make sure I have selected Swift and Storyboard and give next. Create. Now, let's go to view controller. First, I'm going to create a table controller. Let tabbar is equal to UI tabbar controller. Okay, now I'm going to create a function to be tab. In our tabbar, we will have two views, the two view controllers. So let's create our view controllers. Let we see the first VC is okay. First VC is equal to UI view controller. I'm going to set the background color for this VC. First VC dot view dot background color is equal to let it be green. Okay. Now I'm going to create one more view controller. Let it be second VC is equal to UI view controller I'm also going to set the BG color for this one second VC dot view dot background color is equal to let be yellow Okay, now I'm going to create a tabbar item for this view controller. So let item 1 is equal to UI tabbar item. On this one, I will select uh, one with the system item. First one going to be bookmark tag simply zero. Uh, I will copy paste this one here. And here, the second one is going to be download. Let the tag be one, and this one is going to be the second item. Now I'm going to add our tabbar item to our view controllers. So our first we see dot tabbar item so the first VC will take the first item item 1 and the second VC will take the second tabbar item okay now we have our view controller and our tabbar items now I'm going to add this view, uh, view controllers to our uh, tabbar tabbar dot sorry tabbar dot view controllers is equal to first vc and the second vc Now I'm going to set our table view controller as the present view, uh, view of the, uh, our view controller. Self dot uh, view dot. I'm going to setting it as a sub view. Add dot. Sorry, add sub view. And view is going to be our table dot view so it will make sure the present view is going to be our tab bar view so let's run the project uh, I didn't call the function in muted load 
with mistake. Uh, so the tab bar control is working perfectly. Super simple. So guys, thanks for watching.